Question 19. List and state the roles of members of a typical African community. The members of a typical African community include children, young adults, pregnant women, and elderly people. The children play a key role in the community by assisting in making water available at home for food preparation. Some fetch firewood and make it available. They assist in farm work for improved production. They carry farm, farm produce from the farms back to the home. The children equally assist in the selling of some food items in communities where intensive agricultural practices are carried out. The next are the young adults. The young adults constitute the workforce force of every community. The men particularly involve themselves in home construction, a production of roads to excavate areas and create roads, farm to market roads for easy transportation of farm produce to the markets. They assist in selling. Some of them are involved in commerce where they move to other communities. They collect produce from one community and carry to the other community and make available to the community items that are produced elsewhere. The young adults equally are involved in many economic activities, water projects, and community work within to keep the area clean. They are the main force that cultivate farms. They carry the farm produce to the home or to the markets. And they are very relevant in the community. This involves both the men and the women. Next, we have the pregnant women. These are members of the communities that take care since they are mostly at home. They take care of the children. They prepare food for the house. They take care of the elderly people. And they bring forth children to increase the labor force. Lastly, we have the elderly people. These are people who transfer knowledge on food production techniques to the younger ones. They transfer knowledge on food preservation. They settle disputes within the community and they control the rulership of the community where they ensure that there is peace and tranquility within the community. B, state and explain four factors that influence food production in a community. First, we have income. Any community where they don't have enough income, they can't produce food. We have manpower. We have farm inputs laziness, availability of water, and the farming methods. C. State 